All right, good morning, guys. Mr. G back with another two minute game review. Today, we're looking at Hammerheart, and you're going, hey, what is it? Well, you're like, oh, look, it's a cool style graphics, roguelike, medieval, slash them up. Uh, this game's coming in at $10.99 on Steam. Essentially, you're the English, and you're defending waves, or you're defending against waves of Vikings, rather. And they're going for historical realism, so you're not going to have any magic stuff or crazy weapons. You're going to have shield, spear, knife, hatchet. Uh, what you're going to be doing is you're going to be com commanding a group of companions. It feels a little bit like Band of Brothers meets Bannerlord, but it's all in real time. Each match, you're going to get an option to choose a different reward. Maybe weapon, maybe medicine, maybe companion. And what you're going to do is you're going to control your commander using WASD and then fight with the mouse. Feels a little bit like a twin stick shooter. You can slow down time to give commands to your units. And it's relatively intuitive. Feels a little bit like Mountain Blade, uh, but you're on foot and you're going around and you're doing an isometric top-down view. That being said, I jumped in. I enjoyed it for what it is. It is currently in early access of so some quality of life features in the user interface are not really there outside the inventory screen and healing up different injuries which I do like reminds me a lot of stone shard um, and you get to pick up some different perks as you go through uh, however when you do die nothing carries over to your next playthrough so you're gonna be starting from scratch each time um, and you know it is what it is it does what it says on the tin Although it's still in early access and there's not a whole lot there just yet. But if you're someone who's like, I need this, go ahead and jump into it. For me, there wasn't just enough there to keep my attention. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and have this one be a wait and play it later. As far as my personal opinion on this one is, let me know if you've played it, what you think in the comments. I'm going to catch you on the next one. Mr. G, out.